I'm joined by Northwoods League Coach of the Year, John Halama, the Raptors pitching coach who picks up a pretty cool honor in the Northwoods League. John, what's it like to get recognized by your peers? Um, to be honest, the only really ones that matter are the guys out there in the, in, uh, in the bullpen and, uh, and the pitching staff um, trying to help them out and trying to get them better and elevate their games. And, uh, you know, I've been fortunate enough that these guys have been able to grasp it and, uh, and able to take it out onto the field and put it into play. And uh, it says a lot for what they've done. Uh, they've worked really hard. They've dealt with a lot of, a lot of my crap, per se. Uh, but, uh, you know, they, they're a really bunch of good kids. And, uh, you know, hopefully they could continue the success and, uh, and win four more games and uh, win, a, win a championship for the Rafters. You point out the playoffs. We're live on the field just before the start of our first playoff game here and hopefully one of at least four. And the Rafters come into a situation where they're the top overall seed. What are you looking for from these pitchers? They've been great all season long, but it's one and done and things can get crazy. What are you hoping they can give you? Uh, I'm hoping they continue to do the same thing they did all, all season. Um, I'm not going to stop the preparation. Uh, you know, I know that, you know, guys have mentioned why we throw in bullpens because we're preparing for tomorrow. And, uh, you know, I'm not, I'm not here today to lose. Um, and I hope that that's not the mindset of my pitchers. And that's not, definitely not the mindset that I'm, I'm uh, speaking to them in. Um, I'm expecting them to go out there and pitch really well. Uh, Cooper's been phenomenal for us all season, and I'm expecting him to continue to do that and then hopefully lead, uh, drop the game off with a lead in the back end, and then we could have uh, you know, our bullpen pick it up. And, and I mean, enough said about how the back of that bullpen's been going all year. So uh, looking forward to them going to get it done. Well, this is a Lakeshore team that hasn't hit much this season, last in the league in runs scored on the season. They're also very right-hand heavy. So Chris Cooper's a guy who's been very hard on right-handed uh, hitters this season. What do you think he's going to go out there and do on the mound? Uh, well, like I said, I think he's just going to go out there and continue to be Chris Cooper. Um, attack the zone. He really doesn't walk a whole lot of batters. Um, you know, I think his strikeout totals have been up the last, I think, maybe four or five starts. He's been striking out a little bit more uh, batters. Uh, but at the end of the day, I expect him to go out there and, and be Chris Cooper and attack the zone and, and give this team a chance to win. Well, thank you. Good luck tonight. Good luck the rest of the playoffs, and hopefully you can bring home a ring for the Rafters.